Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. This is Rusty78609. I'm here on the bayfront at Goose Island State Park, and I just changed my reservation. I, I had one in the brushy part. I'll show you in just a minute. But instead, I have changed and moved down here to the bayfront. They've got water and electric down here too. And it's uh, just, and since the wind's out of the north, you don't have to worry about uh, uh, you know the salty air and all that stuff you know what I mean because it's blowing the, the blowing it away from you but anyway I need to find my site because she said site number 21 I could be in site number 21 Sunday night Monday night Tuesday night Wednesday night thir Wednesday night yeah Wednesday night and then Thursday I moved to another site and I got to go up there and talk to them about it. But anyway, there's the restrooms with the showers and all that stuff, which I won't use anyway. And, but isn't this nice? <laughs> I got a beach condo. What do you got, dog? Eat your heart out. So now we got to go down here and find site number 21. Because this is the, the, the first one up here is like 24, I think. So we got to go on another side. That's 26. So we'll turn on the windshield wipers, Rusty. Okay. Okay. So here we go, guys. This is, uh, excuse me, Goose Island State Park, Texas, near Rockport, Texas. Temperature right now shows to be about 38 inside of my, well, on the truck thing. So let's go see if we can find site number 21. Yeah. As long as they don't have a hurricane while I'm down here, I'm fine. <laughs> I love this. But you know, always remember, you know, whenever you come into any state park in any state, uh, if you have reservations and you know you get there and you think well you know that's not the greatest spot in the universe you can change if they have a spot available they'll move you you know because sometimes they have cancellations and stuff and but they've got some weird rules like see there's one over there that's really a neat one I can't remember what number 24 or whatever it was and I thought boy that'd be a good one but well that's only for first come first serve and I said well I'm here first well that's only if, if every other side is taken oh okay Okay, so this is number 15, so we got to go a half a mile down here. And I wonder how level these, it doesn't matter, hell, I'll work it out. I don't care what it is. Okay, so she found me site number uh, 10. How can that be site number 10? What happened to site number 21? No, ah, this is the old site number 21 trick. Yeah, I got you now, babe. There ain't no site 21. Oh, there's 19. Oh, here's 20. How oh, we got it. Here's 21 right here. How about this, dog? But what I want to do, I want to back in. I would, I would rather have had a bayfront view, but, 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 we could still kind of get a bayfront view because our, all our stuff will reach, you know. And what I can do, I can kind of, you know what I mean, kind of angle around here some way without, I don't want to back into a building, which I probably will do if I'm not careful. Yeah, we can kind of do like this, you know what I mean? What's wrong with that? I mean, it ain't perfect, but it ain't bad. Uh, let me check something right quick. I'm going to check and just kind of see how level this is, and I'll be right back. Or after these messages, I'll be right back. i got to check my level right quick just to get an idea of where we're at on this thing. Uh, <laughs> yo <laughs> yeah you're gonna have to do a little leveling there boy <laughs> god dang oh well we'll figure it out when we get back let's go up there and change it anyway we told her we would and we will she didn't have any beach fronts here well i got one night on the beach front number 34 anyway so let's go undo the brake let's go Anyway, guys, here we go. Traveling around with old Rusty. Traveling with Rusty. Yeah. Pretty nice little private spot. We'll, we'll figure it out. But yeah, the other spot I had, I really wasn't all that fond of because it was right in the middle of the brush. You know what I mean? It was like a claustrophobic type campsite. And this one, you know, you know, with the temperature like it is, I can go walking out here as long as it's not mist and rain. You know, I can go walking right now. Would I? Hell yeah bundle up and go man I just hope I can find this spot again <laughs> yo 
Yeah, we're here, man. Got something rattling back there. I can't figure out what it is. But this is the Gulf of Mexico in in uh, the little bay areas near the Gulf of Mexico and in, in uh, Texas on the, uh, near uh, you got Port Aransas. Of course, you got South, you got Padre Island near Corpus, and you got uh, of course Rockport. And on we go. And uh, there's a subdivision up here. So yeah, we're doing all right. We're getting it going here. Yeah, I like that down there. It, 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 you've got plenty of places. Well, you know, of course, the weather's going to suck, so I'm not sure how much of this walking around I'm going to be able to do, but we will see what we will see. So i got to go all the way back up to the park headquarters and recheck in. So, you know, the fact that those people had not moved out turned out to be a plus. What I thought was a little bit of a negative turned out to be a plus. It doesn't bother me. I mean, they, they don't have to check out till noon. You know, who am I? You know, I'm just another person in the universe. They got some old buildings done by the uh, CCC back when, the Civilian Conservation Corps back, back in the 30s. There's the old dump station. I can catch it right on the way out when I get ready to go. You know, there are people that come down here and go birding. And even in this bad weather like it is now, there'll be people out bundled up with binoculars stuck on their face. So I got to come back around and get in line to go by the park headquarters here. I'm not sure how I'm going to make this turn. And I would go stand out front there, but I still got to turn around anyway. Oh, I think I can do this. I can do this. One thing good about having this small an RV is you can do stuff like this. But I'm going to have to wait till this guy pulls up. Ooh. You know, that's something I got to remember. You know, those tree limbs hanging out, I run into them all the time. Okay. Okay, we'll park right here. How's that for a view, guys? Not bad. But anyway, guys, uh, the adventures of Rusty continues, and uh, you guys enjoy your day, keep your health, and uh, yeah. Thumbs up, carpe diem, adios, bye bye, buy anything you want anytime. If you think about it, use the Amazon link, I'd appreciate it. Drink plenty of water, stretch, walk. And uh, exercise, do all that stuff, man. Stand guard at the door of your mind. Don't let negativity in. Just keep, you know, what is it? Don't let the old man in who did that, Clint Eastwood. But anyway, having said that, ladies and gentlemen, from uh, a, a nice, not, not very warm, but much warmer, 14, 15 degrees warmer place, uh, this is Rusty78609 saying adios, bye-bye, hasta luego, vaya con Dios, aloha. Till next time, bye-bye.